All right, so everything I'm going to show you is based on an understanding of the overhand slip as the baseline. All right, so I'm going to throw an overhand loop in there, pull a bite up through there from bottom to top, and I've got this. All right, so this is the baseline for all the other knots. All right, this by itself is an overhand slip. If I were to tighten this down, this being the overhand portion, this being a slip. This is also sometimes referred to as a slippery half hitch, but this is not a half hitch. Uh, half hitch and an overhand are two different things, so I refuse to call it a slippery half hitch. All right, it is an overhand slip. So once again, overhand loop, push a bite up from bottom to top, or pull, however you want to do it. All right, if I want to turn that into a bowline, I just take the short end, run it through, pull another bite onto itself, up, run it through, fold it back onto itself, the part that I just put through, and pull. Now I've got my bowline right there. All right. If I take that bowline, run it around the tree and pull the end through, that is a running bowline. So now that same basis for the knot, overhand, sorry, try not to destroy the trees here. Now if I tie another overhand uh, slip, overhand slip, overhand slip, and toggle that, I've now got a marlin spike hitch. See that? If I were to come across, let me lower this so you can see it. If I were to come across, overhand slip, overhand slip, still, overhand slip. Come around an anchor point, come back through that, and I've got the beginning of my trucker's hitch and then I just tie it off on this end. It's still an overhand slip. What else does it do? Overhand slip. If I tighten that down and tie an overhand in the short end as well, basically making an overhand stopper knot on the same side that has the overhand and put that, what do I do with my toggle? Put that on an anchor that is an arbor knot, or a Canadian jam knot, or just a jam knot. Right? All based on the same thing. So, overhand slip can go easily into a bowline, can go easily into a marlin spike hitch, can go easily into a trucker's hitch, and go easily into an arbor knot, or jam knot, slash Canadian jam knot. Thanks.